All right, welcome to InsidePool.tv. We're here live at Billiard Treff 65. This is a match with Matthias Hewer and Christian Schreier. This is Matthias here. And it looks like we're going to be playing a rate to four and ten ball. And we are live, baby, live. From Berlin, my friend. Nope, we're playing nine ball. So that's going to be a race to five on nine ball. Get this going here, Billiard Treff 65. And it looks like Matthias is going to start us off here. And we are brought to you by ProPool.com, NYCGrind.com. And I am Alvaro with Inside Pool Magazine. Here in the final stream from Berlin. Tonight. Christian Schreier step up the bat here. And a swing and a miss. He's going to leave him with a shot. He came off the rail. He was trying to kick it in the bottom right-hand pocket, and he went into the side drink, into the subway, into the tube station. The tube. And he's going to give up ball in hand to Matthias.
that's going to leave him tough on this five ball. He's going to have to kick rail first into the five. I mean, the safety is just kind of touch up against the seven. But these guys are shooters here in Berlin. They, they go at their hole. These guys fire at the hole, I'm telling you. situation here because he has to kick one two rails into the five drop the five he's going to try to put it up in the top right hand corner pocket but I don't think that he's going to be able to make it properly oh he's going up table with this and try to tuck it behind the seven cool All right, my favorite thank you thank you very much thanks Alex They just brought me a beer, so they obviously must want advertised here at Billiard Treff 65. I'm going to have myself a nice Berliner. That's a really nice beer. Yes, German beer is the best beer and it is extremely cheap like 30 cents a pint at the grocery store 30 to 80 cents for a two liter bottle of awesome beer well a pint actually that's not a two liter bottle but hey metric standard who's counting Okay, here comes Christian Schreier. See if we can get a rack done here tonight. Six ball drops. It's gonna get funny on the seven. They're just getting warmed up here. This is a nice little pool room here, Billiard Treff 65. They're starting to get on my good side too. And that's a very difficult thing to do. Okay. Matthias Hua. Seven, eight, nine ball. The nine ball drops, and we are at one to zero here at Billiard Treff 65 here in Vedding, Vedding, Berlin. It is a suburb here in the east side. Behind the wall. 
Is this the west or the east? What? Is this west or east Berlin? West. All right, we're, we're on the other side of the wall here. <laughs> we're on the side you want to be on. My friends. All right, the score is now one to zero in this race to five between Matthias Hewer and Christian Schreier. And this is Christian up to bat. This is Christian right here. He's down one to zero. And we are racing a five. We're brought to you by nycgrind.com, propool.com, and we are inside pool.tv. Coming at you in all three Ds. Nice. That was a really nice little shot there, actually. Looks like a fairly negotiable rack of nine ball here. West side is the best side. <laughs> nice shot. Nice shot. Look at this little nine ball clicker here for the one to one tie up. Not the easiest shot in the world, but if you just roll this ball, oh, so nice and easy. It's a clicker. Tune in your mind here. Ah, I see. Yeah, that was a little off angle. But you got to fire at it. You got to fire at it, my friend. Matthias takes full advantage of that five ball. He's on the 50 yard line here. Okay, one to one here in this race to five. And we are brought to you by nycgrind.com. I'd love for you to go over to nycgrind.com, check out their news stories, Allison Fisher and Jerry Tarantola, as well as the rest of their fine crew, bringing you the news every day. And they do work very hard to let you know about all the 
cool things going on. I want to thank our moderators, Anya and Pops89 Live, for joining us the last two nights. And there is some random dog walking around inside of the uh, pool hall here, which is, uh, I guess, OK in Germany. I guess you're allowed to just uh, have your dogs walk around inside of places and a host of other very strange things, including drinking and driving is legal, uh, walking down the street and drinking beer is legal, riding in a car and drinking beer is legal as a passenger, um, and all kinds of other strange, strange things, but they have a, uh, a really, really nice society here and uh, very highly evolved society compared to our Fisher Price, Sesame Street mentality, United States people. Unfortunately, I have to say that, but uh, not dissing my Americans, but we uh, are lagging in the uh, being fooled by the TV and you know brainwashed by the television thing. Uh, America's got that uh, got that lock lock stock and barrel down pat. Um, the society here is uh, very different, and I don't think the television runs the television and sports world runs the entire society like it does in the United States. Here, it's quite different, but there are some very strange things that happen here, like dogs walking around inside of a pool hall randomly. So very interesting. And people don't clean up after their dogs here in Europe. Their dogs just walk around and do whatever they got to do, and people don't clean up after them. So that's one thing that's kind of strange. There's so many different things about this place. It's, it's so different. Different than the United States and better in many ways. I really can't think of anything that's better about the United States from what I've seen than in Europe. <laughs> Besides, okay, here comes another dog running around with a guy with a seven foot long pool cue case, like a full pool cue in a case. Wow, that is really weird. The people dress really, really, really strange too. Um, you know, you'll have 60 year old punk rocker grandmas with green hair walking around. Guys with swords. I saw a guy with a sword on his back uh, wrapped up in a cloth, like a full, you know, Highlander, Highlander sword walking down the street. Really interesting. Yeah, it's a very, very strange, strange place. Yeah, the Highlander sword guy. Yeah, I don't know what the, about the dogs, what they do on the pool hall floor. I, I, I don't know. I don't understand. But this is Germany, and they have a way of doing things here. It's quite a quite an interesting, interesting place, that's for sure. some uh, really strange guy that is sitting across here from me and he won't stop looking at me. So I'm gonna go walk across the room here for a little while until this guy decides that I'm not the entertainment. So just keep, keep, keep track of everything here and I shall return here in just a few minutes. Here, uh, ProPool.com, NYC Grind, and Inside Pool, as well as SneakyPeatMafia.com, teaming up.
Andreas Moser, bitte. Tisch 3 gegen Konstantin. Den Vereinen, wo, wo Tim Ackermann mit Top ist. Also die, die Vereine, die in den, die, die hat er nur Chance in den Vereinen, die in der Welt Okay. Well, the dogs are tied up next to the snooker table. So, oh, we have another dog in here. We have a, some sort of boxer laying on the floor next to the bar here. Oh yeah, you hear it? All right, I had to turn off the mic there that that guy was talking into the whole time. So there are now three dogs in the pool hall. Some sort of American bulldog it looks like. Yeah, did you hear the police? Yeah, that was that was the European police siren. Let's see if this guy's head's in the shot. No. Nope. The 
I'm going to try to put this microphone back on. So hang in there. Alex B, my production assistant tonight. Yes, we have three dogs in the pool hall. And we're watching Matthias Hewer and Christian Schreier. This is Christian Schreier here. They're racing to five. Looks like we're at two to two. A swing and a miss. Yes, black is clo standard clothing. No, he's still the stalker guy is still sitting there. Now he's drinking a beer. And he's pointed my way, uh, and his legs are spread wide open, pointed at me, talking to some other guy. It's not, not the most comfortable thing uh, ever. But uh, yeah, it's pretty gross. Uh, hey, we're having fun here, you know. Uh, all I can do is continue to stream, continue to stream. <laughs> Glad you guys are having fun out there. What's going on out there, Bora driver? I'm seeing a lot of Boras, VW Boras over here. I've learned one thing about Berlin. The smaller the car you have, the better you are. And people drive absolutely insane. Insane in Berlin. But there's a flow that happens. There's a there's a there's a you know a smooth flow. I do have to say though, the dog is, is pretty darn cute. He's uh, laying on the floor now. Yep, Bora TDI. I went to the Volkswagen factory the other day. It was pretty slick in uh, Wolfsburg. Yeah, Berlin is a lot like New York. It really is. You know, you'll just see you get on a train and there's just some guy just eating dinner, you know, with everybody all around him, you know, licking his fingers and you know, just like nothing's going on, scratching himself, you know. <laughs> That's funny, don't. Yeah, humanity is uh, in your face here in Berlin, just like in New York but there's way less people, of course. Yes, I did a tour of the factory, Bora. It was pretty slick. They actually take you in a bus and drive you right through the factory, one of the wings of the factory. It is actually a, a very, very good place to, uh, to live. I can tell that already, just by the mere fact of uh, the entire system is not made to attack the population like in the United States where the media, the leadership, every single aspect is an assault against the common person's mind and pocket and life. 
you know, in America, the leadership thinks that the worse you are off, the better they are, is a better place to be. Whereas here in Germany, the people are actually not assaulted every day by the leading group of people. Oh uh, yes, thank you, Third Rock. I just, I call it how I see it. And yes. <laughs> yeah, there's actually three dogs in the pool room, not one dog, there's three dogs. Two of them are tied up by the snooker table and one of them's laying on the floor right next to the bar. But this will be my last live stream for a while until Inside Pool revamps. So enjoy it tonight because this is gonna be it for a while. I have uh, gone far enough down the hole for pool. Yeah, very good, Anya. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not going to be gone forever. We're just, uh, I'm just not going to be uh, blindly led down self-destructive paths, pretty much. So when the industry comes up, hopefully I'll come back. We'll see. It's all going to be dependent on that. Yeah, I appreciate it. Don't like that. I'd love to stay with you. We will, you know. Like I said, I'm waiting. I'm going to wait for Inside Pool to revamp, and uh, it's just not going to happen the way it's been happening for the past couple years. Just, it's impossible for me to do it. I mean, it's all my fault that I'm not a good salesman. I'm more of an artist type. I'm not a good salesman, so it's my own fault that uh, things aren't working out right, but I just can't be a salesman and a pool artist and a video technician and a mechanic and a traveler. You know, I need... It's just too hard for me to play all the roles on my own. So I'm going to take a break from uh, pool. And uh, get my life back together. Focus on my future and Alvin's life. Because uh, nobody else is going to do it for me. So, and this isn't, this could be a month from now when, uh, things start working out right. You never know. But uh, I just, I've done, all, I've done my set. I've done my set. So we're going to be glad to uh, be with you tonight from Billiard Treff 65. <laughs> and enjoying this nice, nice future.
this nice, uh, excuse me, this nice tournament here. I was reading the chat. Yeah, you never know what's gonna happen. I do know we're not streaming the Super Billiards Expo for the first time in five years because uh, the tournament director feels that uh, he's not making any money off our live stream. He ain't getting nothing, so. That shows you the state of the industry right there. Pure self-thought only. But uh, I may stay here in Germany, who knows? All right, what's up Baltimore Bullet? Welcome from the fatherland. Berlin. That's funny, Anya. You're a silly one. That's for sure. All right, here we go. We are at three, two, two. Did this race to five. We are glad to have you here tonight for the live stream from Billiard Truff 65. right yeah we're not we're not uh, telling people don't show up to super billiards expo as Anya's saying there we're just saying that we're not allowed to be there because somebody ain't making money off of us he ain't making any money he's only got 50,000 pool players there all paying 10 to 20 dollars but that ain't enough so, got to charge the free live streamers. It's all good, though. Yes, I will definitely. Yes, uh, Baltimore Bullet, we are streaming in a smaller resolution because we do have a very slow internet speed here. So I hope that it looks somewhat normal. It's not gonna be perfect 1080p, but uh, it's a very small frame and it's, you know, as don't light that ass. We are live, baby, live. Very simple. It's not very complicated. The dog stood up and had attention when I said that, by the way. One of the three dogs that are here in the pool room tonight Der Partie nachher im Internet kriegen wir richtig viele Partien zum Zocken. 
The dog is bored with me now. to announce that uh, be taking a break from streaming, but you know, it's necessary. This is a race to five here. Yes, they're talking about uh, the term dogging the ball and the fact that there is a boxer <laughs> sprawled out on the floor. This dog looks really, really comfortable here on the floor of Billiard Treff 65. And we have two other dogs tied up next to the snooker table while their owners play snooker. He does, this dog looks like sugar, except it's white and not 200 pounds.
we want to see we'll give a shout out to our player our friends out there on the chat we got Bora driver buffalo chiggins scorpius dirty bob don 65 don't like that gary 183 i'm good man jim fort collins jim hansen 21 road dog stevie and simonis and of course our wonderful moderators pops 89 live and anya 758 Yeah, don't even get me started about how much uh, time I've spent promoting uh, the Super Billiards Expo, the amount of hours that I worked slaving to uh, make sure that that guy's show looked looked great. Uh, I'm talking about 35 hours straight. Only left to go to the gas station to get food and beer. It came back working two years in a row at least. Two years in a row, 30 plus hours straight to make a great show and got paid absolutely nothing, zero. Last year, as a matter of fact, it took me two straight months of living in a garage, working on cars. I'm done with it. I'm done with it. I'm done giving everything and getting nothing in return. Really done with it. But, uh, you know, not trying to be negative, but I've done my artwork. And I've dealt with all the con men and scumbags. And, you know, I've seen it all from the United States uh, pool industry. And I think that uh, tennis or golf or skateboarding could be a better better venue than uh, laughing out loud pool and billiards in the United States. Um, the bar sport, unfortunately, I have to say that. Uh, you know, all the money goes into the Jack Daniels bottle and not into the to the industry. Nice to see you there, Tony. Welcome. But who knows? Who knows what will happen? Maybe... Uh, Maybe something miraculous will happen for Mr. Calvert and myself. And we will be able to continue on on our own. But as of now, we are at the, I have to even call it, we are at the lowest spot in pool and billiards history. The absolute bottom. It's a really a shame too. So I'm going to go work on cars by myself and live a normal life and stay away from people who want to use me up and throw me in the trash. I'm done with that. This is my last night in Berlin. I'm going back to New York tomorrow and then heading home and trying to pick up the broken pieces from the last two months of streaming shows that uh, gotten me absolutely nowhere. The last year, actually. 
has been a uh, self-destruction sculpture, piece of artwork. I'm going to get back to New York, uh, see if I can get some work, a couple, maybe a mechanic job, mechanic work, a couple cars to work on, or who knows. But that's where it's happening at, is in the big city. Okay, that's the end of the deal there. Christian... Schreier defeats Matthias Hewer here at Billiard Treff 65 from Vetting Berlin. This is Inside Pool and NYCGrind.com teaming up. Brought to you by ProPool.com and Sneaky Pete Mafia. Thank you for joining us, folks. Stick around. We'll have the next match coming up soon. <laughs>